and one of the craziest plays you'll see in college football. Georgia Tech blocked a last second Florida State field goal and returned it for a touchdown, defeating Florida State 22 to 16. First of all, give credit to uh, Georgia Tech. They played a heck of a game. They played very hard, very opportunistic in how they played, took advantage of things. Uh, we had opportunities, they had opportunities, and we always played in a, in a great game, but uh, we have to uh, look at our mistakes, which was a bunch of them. Uh, we left too many points on the board in the red zone. We did not finish. Oh, no, you knew you could return it. We knew to cover. No, I ain't confusing to nothing. That's, that's finishing the game. We knew when there's a block kick, you got to cover. We, we, we talk about that all the time, and uh, they just uh, they got it and went down the sideline. We didn't get him on the ground. It was a tremendous play by them, alert play. We tried to cover it. I mean, I don't think we had to find the ball first. In fact, the first thing when you when the ball is kicking blocked, first thing you go, you're looking for the ball. No, I never played in a game like that. I've never been had lost in a fashion like that. Yeah, I guess when the ball went behind the defense, I guess you know I don't know if guys knew that it was still alive or whatever it was. It's just a misfortune, and then the guy that picked it up and just managed it, you know, score a touchdown. I don't know if guys just didn't know that it was still alive or you know thought that we were going to overtime. All I seen was heads drop. Everybody was went down. It was players. It was players trying to get them, but they can't get them. I mean, I feel like we can we can get it back going. We can do what we got to do. I mean, everything happened for a reason. So just gonna keep practicing, and keep playing hard. It it sucks to lose. Nobody wants to lose, and you know, guys are not used to losing. I mean, I've been here a few years. I I mean, I've lost before, but some guys who's been here who haven't lost in college period. But I mean, you know, guys are kind of you know down. But it, I mean, it's just part of it. You never nobody likes to lose, no matter whether you lose. 50 games a season and no games. Every loss hurts and every loss sucks and guys just kind of, you know, not happy about it. I mean, we just got to bounce back as a team. Kyle, the way, I, my fault starts with me. But we'll line up Sunday, Monday, we'll correct those mistakes and we'll get ready to play Syracuse next week. Next up for the Seminoles, they will return home and take on Syracuse on Saturday, October 31st at noon. That'll wrap up our coverage from Atlanta, LaneHurtSeminoles.com.